Okay, so I'm out here at Castle Boykin Park and things have drastically changed. So this is what we're seeing. Um, still have the open field like normal. The old bathrooms are gone, tore them down. And then you have campsites there. One out there. And then right over here behind these trees here, they look like they started to possibly cut out and make two more new campsites, maybe three. All right, so we got here to the street. All right, so this is the the road you come in. There goes the road down to the, the lake. And there's the first campsite. There is no table. And there's a tractor tire for a fire ring. Alright, so this is site number two, or 16 as they've got it labeled here. Fire ring and the table, I guess, is right there, I'm guessing, for this site. Or it could be for the camper site, I'm not sure. Alright, so there's the, the field. Alright, so you got campsite one, campsite two, and campsite three. Looks like they're starting to uh, to make there. And then you got the site there. And then you got a couple of sites right here in the trees. And then there's the old water fountain and that used to be right outside the old bathrooms which aren't there anymore. Alright, so you got that site there. I think that's the table that goes with that site. And then this site here. You can actually still see the sidewalk that went up to the bathrooms right there. And then uh, we keep walking. And then this is the old double site right here where we used to camp at. So you come in and you used to be able to pull around. So this was our old campsite right here, the old double site. This is the attendant here. But 
Anyway. Pretty cool. And then he got this site way up here on the hill. I'm guessing you have to park down here to get to it. But you got that one right there, which is the one here on the very end of the uh, the horseshoe. And you got a table back there out in the sh out in the sun, and that's the new the new bathrooms. Apparently there is handicapped wheelchair parking way down here. Yeah, so they took one of the, the walking docks out. I mean, that goes all the way down to the, the dock down here, so I'll continue on down. Man, that drive is steep. Crazy steep. bunch of trees down okay so the fishing pier that's what that is okay now I go back up the hill Okay, I'm wore out after coming up that hill. Whew. So, here's the new bathrooms. No showers, just regular bathrooms. And there's the, the big pavilion thing comes all the way up here okay so still got all the campsites up in there those haven't changed And then here's the new boat ramp that they put in. And then there's the walkway. And then all the parking on the parking lot. 
So this drive here is your entry. It goes in here. You circle around and you go out down on the far end down there is where the out is. So there you go. Now this part hasn't changed hardly at all. Like this is all still the same as far as like the campsites and stuff. Since they've added the 30 amp power things out here. Looks like water too. Yeah, power and water. Right, I'm going to cut through, go back to the truck, and I'll drive around to the uh, primitive side and I'll go show you what it looks like. Okay, so I'm up inside. These are the, the campsites up in here. And you got giant chunk missing there. Whole complete end of the table here completely gone and then the uh, fire pits all bent to bent to whatever you got that side over there, and then this side here. And this table's about had it too. We got a chunk missing there. So crazy. And then let's go see what this table looks like over here. Looks like the end of it's missing too. Yep. End of it's missing too. Oh, and the and the <laughs> and this the chair part of it. Missing too. Crazy. All right. I'll walk across the field here. That's where we used to play out here in the field all the time. Now we're back over here by the campsites again. All right, turning off the uh, video. Get back to you in a minute. All right, I'm gonna pull down close to the boat ramp down there, show you kind of what it looks like from here. This hasn't changed much at all as far as this goes. Back 
up to the primitive section. I'll show you what's happened to it. It's pretty bad. So this road here is completely wore out. Well, most of it anyway. Uh, part of the road's been washed out. Big potholes. Um, complete sections of the road just missing. So right here is where the road starts washing out, where it's been washed out from the rain. It's still all washed out. All right, so right there in the corner, used to be a campsite right there okay uh, it used to be a site right there it used to be a site right there and then this site which is right here in front of us you see all this tree uh, debris here that's fell and looks like some of it's been cut up some of it hasn't So, right here's where the, the guardrail starts right there and goes all the way down this, this section here and stops, but you still can't, like, drive into the sites or anything. Like, the sites are cut off. They don't want anybody camping down here. I'm going to park right here. And I'll take the camera out and walk around and show you. Cut the truck off. Okay. So, here's what the sights look like now. Now they've got, like... All these little poles, like a barrier here that you can't get by to put vehicles here. There's the old parking bump there. All right, so. You see where the water's been running from uphill here.
you got this big old pile of trees here and one completely devastated table that table is just done And it has drastically changed from when I was a kid here. And then out here on this point is where we came fishing where Brian got his uh, ear pierced by Gary with the fishing lure. Another devastated table up here on the, the point. Maybe two tables <laughs> from the looks of it. Yeah, it looks like two tables there. shoreline has definitely been washed out a couple of times for sure okay and then you still got like all the guardrail up here Bottom of this seat here is just about broke off. Some fish hopping out there. So, and then there's the old bathrooms there, and they look like they have been tore up. Big old pile of tree stuff there. Wow. Yeah, they've destroyed this bathroom. Holy. Holy moly. This place is nasty and it stinks. Huh. Power cord. That's lovely. So, as you can see, it's still all blocked off. Let's see what the, oh, the women's size just almost as bad. Yeah, I'm not going to go in there. That's, that's pretty bad. Wow, that's very unstable. <laughs> that's crazy.
Yeah, that's a uh, that's quite a ways down there. Apparently, I guess people still come camp over here. Pretty fresh burn. Doesn't look like this side gets used much, if at all. Wow. These tables are crazy. I've had a tractor down here at some point. We old tractor tires there. Tire marks. Some of these tables fared okay. Some of them not so much. Big old burn pile there. Looks like they burned something. This place is a mess. Looks like they're trying to clean it up some. Walk back to the truck now. Taking a ton of pictures. This is the parking space in the roadway. from all the walking but I need to exercise so big old hole in the ground there and there's a kind of a slope right there and then it slopes down that way
way. That's the old primitive section down here below the the top section up here. That's everything that's changed since we were younger. Hope y'all like it. It's kind of a, a different perspective from when we were younger to now. So, anyway. Right, I'm going to turn the camera off. Talk to y'all later.